हेलो स्टूडेंट्स हाव आर यू ऑल आई होप यू ऑल आर फाइन एंड सेफ एट योर होम नाउ स्टूडेंट्स आफ्टर डिस्कसिंग द सॉलिड शेप्स एंड द जोमेट्रिकल टर्म्स विच इज पॉइंट अ लाइन एंड अ लाइन सेगमेंट टूडे वी विल लर्न हाउ टू मेजर एंड ड्रॉ अ लाइन सेगमेंट ओके सो टूडे वी विल लर्न द मेजरिंग एंड ड्रॉइंग ऑफ लाइन सेगमेंट्स अलॉन्ग विद दैट वी विल ऑल्सो डिस्कस अबाउट ओपन एंड क्लोज फिगर so starting one by one very first how we can measure and draw a line segment so students very first to draw a line segment what we need is a scale a pencil and an eraser so if i just draw a line segment here randomly any length is there i don't know what is the length now if it is said that this is a line segment xy and if it is said that measure the length of this line segment so for measuring the line segment whenever you have to measure the line segment you need a scale this is called ruler or scale on this scale if you keenly observe this there are two different scales on this one is having small small division which is called centimeter side and the another one has big divisions which is called inches okay so this is the measurement in terms of inches and the another side where small divisions are there this, these are the scales on centimeter part now since we have to measure the line segment and for measuring the line segment we will use the side on which centimeter scale is mentioned okay now very first as you will observe this scale very carefully it starts from zero it starts from zero right children can you see that yes so whenever we have to measure a line segment what we have to do we have to put this first big division of zero at the starting point so here as you can see that i have kept this division zero at point x now it's time to make the ruler straight and when we measure it here see 0 to 1 1 to 2 2 to 3 3 to 4 4 to 5 5 to 6 do we have reached 7 no it is somewhat less than 7 so if i observe it here it is coming on 6 complete and after that 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 eight small divisions six big divisions and eight small divisions so hence the measurement of this line segment is 6.8 cm which consists of six big divisions and eight small subdivisions right children similarly if i draw one more line segment suppose this is our line segment and if it is said that you have to measure its length right so for measuring the length once again we start with 0 and here if you will observe this it is 0 to 4 that means if i name this line segment as lm so the length of the line segment is 4 cm clear children now coming to the second part where if it is said that draw a line segment ab you have to draw a line segment ab of 7.5 cm if it is said like this that draw a line segment of 7.5 cm so what you have to do you have to keep the scale on like this after that start measuring from 0 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 seven big divisions then how many small divisions that will be separated by the sign of decimal here point so 7.5 so seven complete division and after that five small divisions 1 2 3 4 5 so here is the small divisions so now as you can see i have drawn the line segment and let us give it name ab and this is our line segment with measurement 7.5 cm clear children i hope you have understood how to measure a line segment and how to draw a line segment with the given measurement clear children now coming to the second half that is open and close figure now open 
ओपन मीन्स इन विच द स्टार्टिंग एंड द एंडिंग पॉइंट आर डिफरेंट फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ आई ड्रॉ अ फिगर लाइक दिस नाउ आई हैव स्टार्टेड फ्रॉम दिस इनिशियल पॉइंट ए एंड आई स्टॉप एट पॉइंट बी आर दीज टू पॉइंट सेम नो द स्टार्टिंग पॉइंट ऑफ दिस फिगर और यू कैन से दिस डायग्राम इज डिफरेंट एंड द एंडिंग पॉइंट इज समथिंग एल्स दैट इज वाई दिस फिगर विल बी कंसिडर्ड एज ओपन फिगर क्लियर देन इफ आई कंप्लीट दिस डायग्राम इन दिस मैनर नाउ इफ यू विल क्लियरली ऑब्जर्व द पॉइंट एट विच आई हैव स्टार्टेड आई मूवड अराउंड a square shape and then reach the same point again it means in a figure if the starting point and the ending point meet at the same point then the figure is called a closed figure and hence this is a category of closed figure right children now if i give you some sample of the figures now can you just identify what kind of figure is this the starting point is this the ending point is this since at starting and ending points are different it means it is an open figure clear children now what kind of figure is this as you have observed that i started from this point gone through a triangle and then come back to the same point that means it is a closed figure clear children triangle a triangle it is again a closed figure because the point at which i started i ends with the same so it is again an example of closed figure what about number 8 number 8 is again a closed figure what about number 4 number 4 is an open figure right children because i started from some other point and ends at another point okay children so today as you have seen that we have learned how to measure and draw the line segments so measuring and drawing the line segment using a ruler okay also we have learned how to identify an open and closed figure I hope today's lesson is clear to all of you. Kindly go through your book exercise and complete the rest of the questions in your notebook. Thank you for the lesson students. Have a great day.